piece by piece. One Smith & Wesson M&P AR-15. Fed through an industrial shredder. Kenosha police destroyed the AR-15 site and magazine Kyle Rittenhouse used when he shot three people, killing two of them in Kenosha, August 2020, in which a jury decided Rittenhouse was acting in self-defense. 12 News was not allowed to be present when police destroyed the gun two weeks ago, but did obtain video through an open records request Friday showing police shredding the gun at the state crime lab in Milwaukee. Rittenhouse initially fought to get the gun back, saying he wanted to destroy it himself, but reached a deal with prosecutors for police to do the job instead. The gun never to be used again or become a piece of memorabilia for the man who originally bought it. We did not want the gun being returned to Dominic Black and then having him sell it as Kyle Rittenhouse's gun, like has happened in other famous cases. We didn't think anybody should profit from it, and we wanted it destroyed. Now, I asked Kenosha Police Department what they did with those shredded pieces of the gun after they destroyed it here at the state crime lab behind me. They have not given me a response. Reporting outside of the state crime lab at 11th and Lapham in Milwaukee, I'm Caroline Reinwald, WYSN 12 News. Police had possession of the gun since the shootings. A Kenosha County jury acquitted Rittenhouse in November.